Hey everybody, what is going on? It's Brian with you from the GameCom, and we are playing some more XCOM 2. So, I think we have a... By the way, holy crap, that looks awesome. Is this like an abandoned city? That's what I think it might be. Like, maybe it was a human city that's now kind of destroyed because the aliens are kind of building their own cities? Either way, that looks freaking awesome. Um, but I think we have a console mission um, to do, if I remember correctly. Where are we at? I wonder if that has to do with it. We're kind of in China. Um... What are we doing? We have a console mission, East Asia. We need to extract a VIP from the Advent City. I don't think that's the Advent City in our background. Um, but anyways, let's go ahead and launch this mission. Um, it's going to give us intel, which we need. Uh, it's going to give us an engineer, which is amazing. It is difficult, so... <sighs> Question. I don't think I got um, Luke trained up enough. Yeah, he still needs four more days for stasis training. So I guess we're just going to take A-Team once again with us. Um, I'm kind of tired of taking A-Team. But let's go ahead and launch mission. Yeah, I'm just... I'm thinking. And I don't know... Let's just do it. Screw it. <sighs> like, I'm to the point where I've relied too much on these guys. And if any one of them dies, we're going to be in a bit of an issue. Although, really, if one of them dies, it's kind of minor. If I lose, like, three of them, then we're going to be having some issues, I guess. But whatever. Um, let's go and just start the mission. And uh, we're extracting a guy, right? So it means it's gonna be timed. And hope, hope to God we don't have a king on this mission. <laughs> uh, oh, that's cool. It's like a strip club with fully clothes. Uh, yeah, they're alert nearby. Prepare to engage and eliminate hostile contacts. Uh, we want to extract and deliver VIP. Now, noted. Let's go. Come on, game. Let's load. Let us load, please. Pretty please. Man, it's taking forever. The game even took a while to load up today for some reason, so I don't know what's going on. I am, I do have Chrome open in the background because I'm uploading some videos. And Chrome is a bit of a hog, so that could be part of the issue. Alright, of course we got to climb giant buildings. And we start with the VIP, so... For the uh, not all of my positions. Uh, I'm thinking we're just going to go ahead and run him all the way out here. Like, I guess let's go run up here. Let's take that first run. Um, okay, so there's a group of guys, like, smack dab right on our ass. Enemy squad located. There's Muton, too. Hmm. And an armor guy. All right. Well, I'm glad I didn't run forward, because if I would have done that, we would be spotted at this point. So... We're going to have to engage this group. We will be able to spot them at this point. The question is, I almost don't want to waste my turn on him. Uh, but I think we will. I... I just don't want his cover to break quite yet. So let's go ahead and move our heavy up here. We know we want him here. We're going to definitely be shooting some grenades. I need to break the armor of the Muton and the other guy. We might be looking at flashing these guys too. Depends on how they position themselves. Um, We can get the both these guys and most of their cover. So I'm thinking that's probably going to be what we want. We'll get both guys. We'll have his full cover. Um, what does this look like? We have massive hit bonus because they're um, because we're up high. So, yeah, I think this is going to be our best choice right away. Can we get both covers? I don't think so. We can get both covers, but then we can't get the muton. Right here. We're only in half cover, and we're totally floating right now, but <laughs> we are at a height advantage, so I think we're okay. We only shredded one armor, which is a bit on the disappointing side. I think we're still fine, though. Okay. Who's next? Our sniper can get shots off on everyone. Yeah. Okay, so who has the most HP right now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Well, both these guys, eh, I don't know. So we want to lightning hands one of them. Um, we can definitely hit you. You're at 97%. You're at 85. So let's not potentially waste it on that guy. Let's instead go here, do the lightning hands, take my free shot, 
And then when I face off, I should be able to get the kill on that guy. So face off and murder everyone. Well, we'll get hopefully one kill. Please get a kill here. Ah, that's what I was hoping would not happen. Uh, well, we put them all pretty low at least. So let's see. We got three guys left, and there's three guys with HP. You have a auto hit no matter what. Um, Who had the lowest... I want Apophis. I'm pretty sure we're going to use him to go for this guy right here because... Who is the hardest to hit? You have a 96. You have an 85. He has the best aim, so that's why we're going to take this shot here. We just missed an 85% shot. Are you kidding me, game? All right. Wow. Um, not you. So, we're going to go ahead and overdrive now, and... Pray our robot can do what our best aim dude can't. You know, I totally forgot we have a PCS that we didn't Father give. Really we also probably have some weapon upgrades we need to use. Um, so 88, 78. Well, you can only see these two guys, so there you go. We should have taken the lower percentage chance first. I didn't think about that. <laughs> 63, I believe in you. It's like we missed an 85. Surely we're not going to miss an 85 and a 63 on the same freaking turn. All right. Uh, then Hannibal. This isn't actually cover. You actually do have a shot on him here. So it's a 72 or we just shock him and kill him. I think we're just going to shock him and guarantee the kill. I, I don't want to risk it, so. We're not in great position, so let's just finish him off. This is it. Goodbye. And that's partly why we brought him on the mission instead of our stasis, dude. See, this would actually have been a perfect time to use stasis. So, uh, you, sir, I guess we'll move you here and hunker down. It doesn't really matter. So, we're one turn in, and we moved about three feet. Good job. <laughs> uh, McLean. Let's go ahead and run you up here. What do we get? Illyrium. Hey, Illyrium cores are amazing, so I need those. Actually, I think I need the crystals, don't I? But whatever. Uh, is it on top of this building? It is on top of that building. So we're actually not that far from our target. Which way is going to be safer? Good question. Probably here. Yeah, this will be safe here. I'm, I'm going to leave that side open just a little bit for view over here. Um, Nicholas, we don't need to reload you, so I'm just going to go run you all the way over here. Because we shouldn't be able to spot anyone. If we spot someone, then it's going to be a little busy, but we should be fine. Uh, you, sir, need to reload. It's kind of unfortunate, because I'm going to be wasting a turn reloading with everyone. Reloading. We're not going to get that far with him or Apophis. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, you are fine. Good to go. So, let's run you all the way back here. I think I'm just going to run you... Uh, I think I'm just going to put you right here. She won't be in cover, but it doesn't matter. Because we shouldn't spot anyone. I always hate, though, running someone forward and not putting them in cover. There's always a part of me that's like, ah. <laughs> um, I'm going to put you right here. We're just going to move everyone in a line. And I have to reload with Apophis since he has one freaking shot. And he misses one freaking shot. <sighs> like, I'm kind of bitter about that. Like, <sighs> what, are the, mm, just what are the odds? I mean, 85, obviously. But still, come on. We'll keep you back a little bit. And I'll actually put him in cover. Only because we'll straight fail the mission if he dies. And he has, like, no HP either. Where my guys should all be able to survive a shot, I would think. I would hope. Moving. I thought you had better movement range. The other thing, too, is he'll be Overwatch because he's running with the second move. No. He has, to, he has to run with both moves. 
All right, so we're going to probably get a spot off. Maybe? Maybe? Dang it. I actually wanted them to spot me. Hmm. I know we're in a terrible situation. We're, like, not in good cover for that, but... Um... Can we actually see through this door? I think we can. We'll move him up here. I need that person to move. That's actually exactly what I wanted. Uh, except now he's way up there. But that's okay. So let's move you here. Heading to that location. And then we're going to move you right here. So we do have vision on them. We're, we're still a turn away from being able to doing, doing anything against these guys. Um, I am going to go ahead and run you up here, though, just so you're close. I, you running anywhere. <laughs> ah, I love the Julian voice. He's great. Uh, and then I can use him now as some cover. I could also put a guy right there. Uh, but that might actually get us some spotting. So I'd rather maybe just put you here. Um, aliens. Really? That's spotted? Alright. Screw you two, game. Where, who has my flashies? You have my flashies. Um, I don't know I can actually get my flashies into a good position here. What? Let's, let's look at this real fast. If it does something like stun enemy for one turn, then hell yeah, we're gonna hop on it. Uh, small cash, large cash. I don't really care. We're probably going to do that. Uh, but not this turn. So this is when it would be a really good time to have the flash grenade on Jason. I could launch the frost bomb in here, but can't do anything. If I could launch the flash in, we'd be in a great position. Uh, Kazacelli. We... Yeah, I don't care about that. Um, haywire protocol, combat protocol. We want the flashbang. Is this actually hit this guy? Ooh, we can hit all three. Now, I don't think the robot can actually get stunned now that I think about it. Whatever. We're going for it. Yeah, we can't disorient the robot. Crap! So... We can shadow fall you. My question is, do we actually need to... Uh, I'm going to put him here. So he can actually... Ooh, he actually has a shot. 55 on the officer. Probably not worth it. Uh, you, sir, I'm going to have run over here and hide. The question is, what are we going to do? I could frost bomb this guy, but if there's still a king left, we're going to really regret that. I could also go ahead and try grenading these two. See, I'd almost rather do that to open it up a little bit more. But maybe this will open up a little bit of vision. I get... Ah, oh, crap. You know what I should do? Yeah. Because I'm in half cover right here. In the front line. I need to aid protocol him. Uh, we do now have shots on everyone. But I moved already, didn't I? Yes, I did. Crap. So, I could go Shadowfall. I could Battle Scan. Battle Scan doesn't do anything. I think I just need to shoot you with my pistol. That's about all I can do. The guaranteed damage doesn't really help me much. Um, these guys are both gonna miss, and I don't think I can kill this mech. Unless Apophis can shoot it from across the map. Went off the armor. It did enough. <sighs> so, I think my only option here is I'm gonna aid protocol. I hate this, but I'm gonna aid protocol you. I'd rather, uh, overwatch with him, but he's in half cover, and he's smack dab in the attack range. Now, um... Barca might get shot at now instead, but he doesn't know. I, see, I don't know. We only really have to worry about the robot. They both Overwatch, so that's totally great. Ooh, Overwatch. Well, 
Why does he have an Overwatch? How? How do you have an Overwatch? Remote hacking, volatile mix. If you spend all your actions on moves, yeah, no, no, we know that. Threat assessment, aid protocol now grants a covering fire Overwatch, but it, aid protocol is increased. Oh, that is awesome. All right, so that's why. Now we just have to worry about these two douches who are in cover. Um, she had a pretty good chance. No, she didn't. So it might just be robot time to blow them up. The problem is I don't have good aim on either of them. Um, what about six? 76%. It's a free action. Wait a second. John McCain has Shadow Step. All right, screw it. Let's totally break this. Um, yeah, this should be okay. My only problem is if we trigger another enemy wave that's through here. So I don't know if this is worth it. Option B is we shoot a rocket and blow them all to hell. And that might just be the safer if I can get a rocket in here. Can I get a rocket in here? There we go. Yeah, let's just do the safer rocket shot. <sighs> well, killed one of them. <laughs> and we removed his cover. So, who is kind of... Okay, pistol, shooting pistol does not end my turn anymore. But I, I can't actually see. Well, that sucks. Do we just want to pistol you? Is there something else that needs a kill? Maybe Barca? I'm trying to just debate who get the kill. Or maybe the robot. Screw it, robot friend. Oh, I just shot my rocket with my robot friend. friend. Ah. I'm going to actually put her up here. I guess that'll be okay. Long story, but I'm trying to get this human to move out of the way so I can actually move McCain into a spot in which he won't get spotted. All right, now he's still getting spotted. Uh, oh, you know, it's because that guy's still alive. All right, let's just use Barca. Se, se lo dici tu. And 97. Get the kill. Oof, crit. That was nasty. That was nasty. I'm enjoying it, though. That went well. All right. Um, can I now move McLean? Yes. And we can actually run this way. So let's. We could almost actually get him out in one turn. So let's move him all the way up here. Actually, let's put him right here. Because that'll give me vision up top and it'll give me vision of the street. I know there's another enemy wave somewhere out here. We just got to figure out where the crap it is. To designated position. Or maybe not. Maybe we're perfectly okay, as is. Um, do I just want to run you up here, then? I guess. Why not? Well, I guess we'll just run you here. And if I pop another wave, I'm going to be a little on the pissy side. Just throwing that out there. Oh, it's a clothing store. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go away, human. It's a clothing store. It's not a clothes strip club. That makes a lot more sense. Although, I kind of blew up all the women clothing. <laughs> you know what's hilarious? There's a human right here, and she looks she's wearing the exact same outfit. <laughs> also, she's in a really bad spot. It's like, you probably shouldn't be standing here right now, just throwing that out there with all the aliens and the explosives. <laughs> uh, I do enjoy how in this game you can uh, like murder civilians, and it's perfectly acceptable. So we just got these two left. Um, I'll just move you right here for now. And we'll move our human our scientist engineer dude all the way up here and he'll be in full cover and we're gonna wrap this episode up i think
Holy crap! What the heck? What the heck? Oh my god. Um. Oh my god. Okay, at least we got that off. <laughs> Holy balls. Like, Jesus. Did you. Do you have your free shot up? You do have lightning hands available. Um. Can you actually see him? No, you can't. Dang it. We're going to have to move everyone to actually do crap. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, I should have put her right here. I almost put her right here. And, oh my god, he just... Oh, hell. Uh, so let's see, what do we need to do? We're going to frost bomb him. Then we need to, like, shred him. What is your chance? 70%? Can I, I can't overdrive. I need another turn to overdrive. Um, so instead, we're just going to have to fire a weapon and try shredding his armor. Um... See, the other reason to not have Frost Bomb on this guy is he actually can shred. Unfortunately, he won't be able to shred because he's going to use his entire turn launching Frost Bombs. Which is really crap. Ugh. Yeah, we're in a bad spot. We're, we're not doing good. But anyways, that's going to be next episode. So I hope you guys are looking forward to it because I'm sure as heck not. But anyways, um, go ahead, drop a like on this one, comment, let me know what you guys think, and hit that subscribe button. Join the comments, show your support. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.